Have you thought about, really thought about the reason that you, you market your business? Why? Why do you market your business? For most of us, it's really simple to define the objective. We want to sell more. We want to make a, more of a profit. We want to help our cash flows, but maybe selling. If you're a not-for-profit, it might be donations, or it might be to do certain good and so on, or to raise awareness. But it's really important that we start with what our business objectives are. What are our business objectives? And then we work backwards and say, how can we use marketing and advertising for that matter to meet our business objectives? A lot of large corporations, government departments and so on are very formal and they create something called a marketing plan. And a marketing plan, um, you know, they do differ, but they can be very specific about defining the demographics, uh, the gender of people, uh, where they live, their income groups, all sorts of different things and target their marketing towards that. But it's a very formal process they might go through. Now, for small businesses, of course, it's, it's often difficult to be quite so formal. Um, but it is, again, very important to think, what is the end objective? How are we going to use marketing to meet that um, end objective? Now, two terms that are, are important, uh, well, I think anyway, particularly in, in marketing, is, is one called top of mind. And this is where MailChimp do, you know, can really help us. Top of mind is, um, is about when, when our customer, consumer, uh, thinks about our category, uh, our brand category, we immediately come into their mind. So a lot of car companies, for example, they know people don't buy a car every single day. It's a, it's a big expense. But they advertise, they promote often, so that when a consumer comes to make that purchasing decision, the brand immediately pops into their brain. Toyota, Ford, Mercedes, whatever. Okay, and, and MailChimp can certainly help us with this top of mind because we want to occupy that space in our consumer's mind that when they think of our you know, a, a product we sell or, or the, you know, whatever we do, they think of our brand. Um, also, what's important is something called customer lifetime value. Customer lifetime value is how much is a customer worth to us over their entire, uh, um, over the entire life they're a customer with us. Now, we could substitute the word for customer for um, donor or, or, or something like that, but but I'm sure, I'm sure you understand, um, because a customer is not just a once-off, let's say, purchase. It might be a series of purchases. It, you know, the relationship we have with a customer is really just a once-off. Um, we try to make it more than that. And again, Mailchimp can really help us with this customer lifetime value, as it does with the top of mind. So um, I've spoken very briefly about sort of you know, a, a, a marketing strategy and, and, you know, what goes into that marketing strategy. And again, it's about, you know, demographics, all those things. And it might even go down to what, you know, what's, what kind of campaigns we use. Do we use advertising for those people, but not those people? Do we send um, postcards to those people, but not those people and so on? But all of this comes down to our business objectives, keeping our brand in uh, top of mind of our consumer and also trying to increase the customer lifetime value. And of course, MailChimp, because it's it's more than just an email marketing uh, platform now, it's it's a suite of of um, marketing abilities and, and, and services and products. We can use these different products and services such as uh, Google retargeting ads. So when someone visits our, our, um, our store, you know, maybe an advert will, they'll keep seeing an advert of ours, which will, will keep our brand in the top of their brain. Email marketing is very good for top of mind um, as well, keeping reinforcing. Um, saying that, uh, an example I, I always use in training is, um, you know, something we need to be wary of as well in our marketing plan is sending often enough, but not too often. We want to send often enough so people are, so our brand is top of mind, top, you know. Um, but on the same token, we can't, seen too often otherwise people will see it as spammy i guess uh but also people just switch off from our message so we couldn't send an email twice a day for example saying buy our product buy our product or this product's on sale that product's on sale this product's on sale that's product and sale. it's a very common error companies make because they know they need to be top of mind so the way to get around that issue for example um 
is what we would do is well look at the frequency but maybe people maybe certain you know organizations do need to to market often you know advertise send postcards email marketing etc quite often but often what helps there is is you would have in that example of sale 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 you'd maybe send one every few days saying sale whatever the case might be but what you'll do is the other messages then you will you will add value to the consumer so um I worked with a flower seller, for example. Um, they were selling a lot of flowers. They were sending a lot of buy your roses, buy these flowers, buy those flowers, and people were just switching off. So I mixed up the message a little bit. Uh, you know, maybe the, the message was then, how do you, you know, have a short video of how do you keep your flowers fresh? And that might just be one uh, campaign. Your next one might be buy our fresh roses. The next one might be um, why XYZ flowers are so popular at this time of year and so on. So we add education and a benefit to the consumer and then also um, ask them for the sale. So yeah, marketing uh, a marketing plan is really just being conscious um, about our marketing activities. We then use MailChimp and the various different types of campaigns to target those various demographics and, and help increase our lifetime value.